Hello, hey, this is a rank sentimentalist, and this is my Sims 3 Island Paradise expansion pack Let's Play. I totally love The Sims. Most of the games I play, I am like invading countries or shooting planes down or things of that nature, but I find The Sims just totally relaxing uh, as a technical accomplishment. The fact that you know, in these, these large numbers of people can remember the relationships between each other. I find just brilliant. I wish uh, sometimes that Total War the diplomacy worked as well as the relationship system in The Sims does. Okay, so first we're going to take a look at The Sims we're going to use uh, for this Let's Play. And we really want to explore uh, all the different uh, new... Uh, explore all the new mechanics and all the new uh, gameplay elements in Island Paradise. So the head of the family is Peter Lawrence, and uh, I thought it looked kind of like Peter O'Toole and Lawrence of Arabia. So Peter Lawrence, his uh, personality is uh, he's artistic, charismatic, he's handy, he's a natural cook, and he's a sailor. So he's kind of a jack of all trades. He's going to be kind of our resort owner. He's going to be the, the business manager, and that's his lifetime wish, is to have a resort empire. Uh, Scorpio, tri-tip, island life, and his favorite color is white. Okay, his girlfriend, Rihanna St. Louis. Now, well, first of all, let me say, I didn't create any of these Sims. They're all community-made, and uh, some of the folks out there that make these are absolutely, you know, just brilliant. It must take them just, you know, especially the first time they did it, just, you know, dozens of hours to get to get these models looking as good as they do. And I think this is, might be Bob Skellington. I know Dana is Bob Skellington, but him and there are a bunch of other folks out there, you know, check out the exchange. There's just a lot of good stuff. But anyway, she's his uh, girlfriend. And uh, she wants to be a singer. Or she can hang out at the club and sing, maybe. Uh, artistic, great kisser, irresistible, natural born performer, and a sailor. And her lifetime wish is to be a vocal legend. Pisces, uh, Porcini Risotto, Beach Party, her favorite color is red. And. Nagi Boos Kania. Her voice. Zondel Matzo, Tor. His voice. And then you've got uh, Peter's sister, Dana. And she's gonna want she wants to be a lifeguard. And she's athletic, she's good, irresistible, loves to swim, and she's a party animal. Yeah, she's a sea, uh, seaside savior. Rescue fifty sims of lifeguard is her lifetime wish. Uh, favorite food is dim sum, beach party, favorite color is black. Chan Bobby Pazzle. And there's your boy. And she is a Sagittarius. And we've got a friend of hers, uh, Kira Thank Mitchell. And I call her Kira because she looks like a lot like Kira Knightley. And it, this, well, that wasn't the name of the model, but uh, that's just the way it turned out. But then just you know, another great looking model. And she wants to be a deep sea diver. Uh, she's an angler, she's athletic, she's brave, she's got a good sense of humor, and she also loves to swim. And deep sea diver, mastering the dive skill, earned 40,000 simoleons from selling diving collectibles, is her lifetime wish. Okay, so let's just check, uh, check out all the outfits here. Yep, so. This is every day. Hopefully these won't take too long to load. I do have a lot of custom content. Like I think all the hair that all four of these sims have is all custom That's with cool. custom meshes. Uh, formal. I think uh, here's a little something for the ladies here, Lord so to speak. Uh... Athletic. Hmm. 
Maybe yo. Swimwear. We let go. And so I said, yeah, he's kind of the business manager and he's going to kind of run the family. Uh, he'll have actually the most skills to learn. You know, handiness, like cooking, mixology. Why do those... Stupid things keep coming back. Yeah, I took those off once already. So, I wonder if that goes with the sweater. No. Anywho, that's kind of his, uh... You know, outerwear, you're thinking outerwear on an island, maybe you know what you wear during a hurricane. Now, I definitely uh, like the little stories you make up, and Please just playing stop. Sims is kind of a creative experience. There's her every day, and I know the top is from the, uh, is one of the new women out, uh, female outfits from uh, Island Paradise. And then there's formal... And yeah, her backstory is that she's actually uh, from the islands. You know, Peter met her down here. You know, their boyfriend and girlfriend so right now. Bonita. Who knows what's going to happen? You know, she wants to be a singer. He wants to be a club owner. Will he not, he'd turn out to be a good guy or not? Rafia. Snar. Kushla. Nushki Zanzi. Do you have to have gloves on for outerwear? Maybe that's it. Okay. So, lesson learned here. You need to have some type of glove, I guess, for outerwear, or it's going to give it to you. from uh so so I'll be back. Okay, we got the uh, glove situation remedied. So, uh, so this is us uh, and Dana Lawrence. It's Peter's sister. He kind of looks out for her. You know, she's kind of the wild party girl. Uh, he wants to start a resort. She wants to be a lifeguard. So, uh, yeah. So we'll see how that turns out. Yeah, I mean, I love The Sims, but definitely it is. Uh, it can be glitchy very particular in how you you know load mods if you lose a lot if you use a lot of mods uh, I had a lot of mod mismatches when I uh, when I did the this robber. when I did this install anything to do with uh, clubs staying open or people going to clubs uh, townies seem to cause uh, Actually, it did cause the uh, mm -hmm. the harbors and the beaches not to work, and the resorts. And I had a mod with uh, hidden traits, 
and that was causing uh, basically Love to Swim and Sailor not to appear. So, so. Nice look. And here we have gloves. So, As yeah. that. So she's friends with, uh, I think Dana, I said, I think Dana was made by Bob Skellington. So definitely check out his stuff on the, uh, uh, on the exchange. Gazork. And here's Kara, who's Dana's friend from, uh, from dropping out of college. You know, what I would love to do eventually is uh, start these folks off at university because that would even give them, uh, you know, more money. You know, start out with, like, I don't know, fifteen or 20000 with four people probably. I don't know, maybe even more than that for, for scholarships and whatnot if you train for a few days beforehand. Yeah, she wants to be a deep-sea diver, so she's kind of the... Uh, the badass chick. But definitely we want to ex fully explore uh, scuba diving and whatnot. So everybody's going to be spending a lot of time on the water or in the water. Bapu. And everybody's got some kind of uh, uh, trait that benefits them, whether it's sailor or, 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 or swimming. But it should be a very interesting story. So cool. So, so the synopsis is that uh, Peter Lawrence has moved down are? here to start this club, but become a resort wizard of the uh, of the Caribbean. He's got a girlfriend, uh, Rihanna, who wants to be a singer, and he's thinking, you know, maybe, just maybe, she can sing at the club. His sister's down here, and she brought yeah, her friend so along. Lovely. Right now, they've got some money, but they're all living on a houseboat together, Abby. so uh, we'll see how it goes. I think we're all set here. Gazork. Now, we're going to call this Club Paradise, because as I said, Peter reminds me of Peter O'Toole, and uh, that was a movie back in the 80s. It took place in the Caribbean where Peter O'Toole ran some resort. He was like a governor general of some wacky island. Anyway, edit relationships. So Rihanna is his girlfriend. Dana is his sister. And Kira here is just a housemate. So here we go, and next we'll check out the town. Okay, so this is uh, Isla Paradiso. This is where we are right here, Club Paradise. Whoa, change ports. Let's not do that quite yet. Now let's check out the map, and I'll show you some of the new features. So uh, the palm trees here represent resorts. There are two nice five-star resorts that you can go to. And there's a variety of services that uh, you can partake in while staying at the resort. And over here is the crappy little resort you can get for free uh, when you're just starting out. It's called Hobart's Hideaway, but uh, you can change the name of it to whatever you want to. Um, so I actually did add, in, let's say, about a dozen or so sims, so we'll meet them along the way. We added the, uh, for the singing career for Rihanna, we added the live show venue. We added a coffee house, and I actually put in the stage myself there, so we'll see if that works or not. Um, we put in a dance lounge, Club Cabana, and this is all from the exchange. Uh, this is this is a Isla Paradiso Amphitheater, and I can't remember what it's called exactly, but I just downloaded this today off the exchange. The Edge is the exclusive club, and here's the Ankh. That's a let's see. It's a dance club. Hold on one second. I'll be right back. Yeah? Okay, never mind. They're right. 
Uh, so this is, yeah, this is the poolside club, and that, uh, this is the poolside club, the Ankh, and Club Cabana is the dance club. Uh, for new features, I'm saying for new features here, we've got uh, the beaches. And that's where the lifeguards go to work every day. Uh, besides the resorts here, so we are to cover the resorts, the beaches. That's where the lifeguards go to work. Uh, the different docks are where you can move your houseboat to or build a new houseboat. Um, there are a few empty ones. And there are dive points. Davy Jones Locker, Pearls Deep. You start off the first one, I believe, is Rocky Reef, which is over here. And then there's the Mermaid's Grotto. I know there are a lot of people interested in mermaids. Uh, so I put in, let's see, I also put in uh, a uh, back lot, movie back lots. Uh, that is a big venue. The private venue we put out here on the. This is the a local hangout. The hideaway. That's also from uh, the exchange. And out here, somewhere, we've got a Club Tropicana, a private venue. Okay, uh, let's see. Anything else I want to point out? I think that is about it. So we will get, I'll be right back and we will get started. All right, I'm back. So usually the first couple of days of my sim life, my sims lives, are uh, like basic training. So especially now we have a little extra money We want to spend a couple of days just kind of, you know, relaxing, checking things out uh, before we all get working and whatnot. So basically build up our skills. So uh, Dana, Kira, and Rihanna are going to the gym to work out. And Peter is going to the bookstore to, uh, you know, to buy some recipes in a book or so and uh, become a partner here. So recipes, we're just going to go ahead and buy all the uh, recipes up to level 3. And skills, we are going to buy Mixology 1 and Mixology 2 and Mixology 3. Okay. Now he's going to become a partner. Okay, they're at the gym. So let's see. And here is the mascot. Yeah, we don't care about you, sir. So next time what I'd like to do is start off at university.
I hate going jogging. I might as well have Peter come over here too. We'll all get a little exercise. Exercise machines. Swimming. And because they're athletic, we'll give them good pacing. Well, he might as well go home then. I put in some additional bathrooms over here. That's what we'll have them do.
speed this up a little bit. Yeah, so the first couple days can be a little, uh, a little boring. Just because, yeah, if you get a little out ahead of the power curve, as far as your skills go and whatnot. Too much salt. And he's going to start reading that. So he's not. First he's going to send a text to Dante Mitchell. Start reading that. Let's see. It's gonna go out snorkeling. Right after Dante Mitchell. Texting. my text. So the three girls will go out snorkeling while Peter stays in and studies. And you can actually make quite a bit of money snorkeling. Finding stuff and selling it. And I don't think we'll learn the scuba diving skill today. Might as well buy one of those uh, one of those kits. Where are they? Hobbies and skills. Yeah, there it is. somebody boating by. Why did she stop snorkeling?
you know, use the facilities, then uh, cook dinner. Everyone else is out there snorkeling. Ooh, ninety-one dollars. I think her athletic skill might be stuck on. Okay. Mm I'm just going to reset her. I'll be right. Uh, actually, they're just going to eat and go to sleep, so we'll pick this up tomorrow morning.